This is day 105 of isolation. We haven't been out to the modern world in almost a third of a year. I'm iron depleted, protein depleted, and more importantly, curl depleted. You see, boys, most of us probably think you can't get a solid arm workout, a good pump. Curls for the girl. I guess there are no girls around at this time, but curls for the FaceTime girls at home. Mm-mm, you can. And it's not because I'm a calisthenic pro, but more so because I've had to figure out what the hell to do at home to hopefully keep some sort of muscle mass on my bicep. Today, boys, I'm gonna give you a five minute arm workout routine that I developed that every time I do it, I get the sickest arm pump. I kid you not, this is probably gonna be harder than the curls you're used to doing in the gym. The workouts are simple. There's gonna be five movements that you can follow along with me right now. Each movement, we're gonna spend one minute on the movement. We're gonna spend 50 seconds of the minute working and the other 10 seconds resting and moving on to the next movement. In total, it'll be five minutes. All right, we're gonna start with tricep dips. 50 seconds working. Now, the goal with calisthenics and the only way this works is if you keep your movement slow and control, really contract on top. That there is what's gonna give you the sick pump that I'm talking about. That's the one thing that I've realized with calisthenics movements during these two years in isolation, you moving fast and bouncing up and down completely takes your completely defeats your purpose. You want to keep those muscles under tension for as long as possible throughout the duration of the movement, the same as if you had weight loaded on to your triceps. All right, <clears throat> we're coming up on the 50 seconds here. All right, rest. For this one, we're hitting the floor. We're gonna do reverse hand push-ups. So this is how you usually do a push-up, where I want you to invert your hands. This is gonna target your arms like crazy. Rest. We're gonna stay on the floor. We're gonna rest 10 seconds. All right? And we'll go straight into tricep plank push-ups. Again, this is strictly body weight. Control the movement, do not bounce. All right, here we go. You're just pushing up, right? And then down. Push up, down. You wanna control that movement as much as you can, especially on the way down. Oh, it gets really, really tough. Oh. I want to quit so bad. My arms are on fire. Rest. Holy crap. All right. So this next one, you're gonna need a counter, a ledge, a table, somewhere where you can put your head underneath. And we're gonna be doing arm curls with a counter or a table. Basically, at this point, your, head, your, your arm should be blasted. Going for 50 seconds. You really wanna contract on top, okay? Careful here. 
if your arms are already giving out, it's better that you rest versus you slipping up. last movement we're gonna do back pulls if you have a pull-up bar I'd rather you do pull-ups for the next 50 seconds but I'm assuming most of you don't have equipment so you could use a broom make sure it's sturdy enough it can hold your weight if it's bent don't use it but if you have one use a broom two chairs this is gonna limit your range of motion but this is just an impromptu hack if you don't have a pull-up all right put it here we're gonna pull up Squeeze. Since I don't have range of motion, I really like to hold it on top and let it burn. one round. My arms are on fire. Now, you know what I'm gonna say. If you're a real beast, if you're a real animal, five minutes isn't enough for you. Take a two minute break and let's do it all over again. But if you're not, and if you're just starting, just five minutes, boy, you see this? That's actual sweat. Five minutes. My arms are on fire. And you can do it from the comfort of your home. No excuses, boys. That's it for me in today's video. If you do do this workout, comment, drop a comment down below. I wanna see, I wanna know your results. And if it was tough on you, if it was easy, how many rounds you did. And if you wanna see more at-home workouts, again, drop a comment down below what body part you want me to hit next. Yo, but I'm kind of having fun with this. This is better than going to the gym.